So, first of all, hello and welcome to the set of films about the Calidus tile script system. Um, first of all, a little bit of background about where this system comes from. Uh, and I'll be assuming here that everybody watching this film is familiar with Calidus and tile planning in general. Um, if I go to the material editor and we look at a general tile here, what you can see is you you normally just, if you're dealing with square tiles, you've just got the width and length of a tile, that's all you want to put in. And I, I would say straight away that if you are dealing with square tiles most of the time, then quite honestly you, you probably won't need tile script. Um, tile script is another way of defining a tile grid. So where you've got a square tile, all you've got to do is pop them in there. Um, in the past we've had this designer system here which allows you to build up a grid using um, separate elements of tiles and apply images and rotations and things like that and it did it does work it does work pretty well but what we've found over the years is that um, designers are asking for more complex tile systems and also I think we're getting into the aspect where where customers are not just or Calidus users are not just having to work out quantities but they're also having to present designs to customers with images and almost photorealistic type of work and the scripting system we put in um, builds the same set of tiles that the designer would build but it builds them differently and it's a lot more flexible and it's a lot more powerful and quite honestly once you get the hang of it it's a good deal easier to use I mean I've I quite often get sent designs that people have said you know can you try and put this together because we're struggling with the designer and quite often if Calidus users are struggling with the designer when it comes into us we struggle with it too but in every case if we switch over to the script we're able to do it in a few minutes so it is something whereas if you're if you're dealing with complex grids then the scripting system is something that's worthwhile looking at what I'll do is if I just um, let's have a look at this one here oh, that one there this is um, a fairly if you were doing this in the uh, Calidus Designer, it's a fairly complex setup to do that because you've got a pinwheel design here, so you've got four elements, you've got an element in the middle, and the next one down is shifted across by a full tile. So you could do that in the Designer, but let's just have a look at the script here. Um, what we've got is the script works really by typing in a set of commands, and each command is interpreted by Calidus and it does something to the set of tiles that it's building up. Now I'm not going to go into the, any any of the great any great, great detail here, but just to bear in mind that this pinwheel here design has been done with three lines, and that also includes setting all the colours for the pinwheel. And so, uh, and you could probably get rid of one of those lines as well. So this is an example of how a relatively complex design uh, that you need to put into Calidus can be put in very very easily once you've understood what's going on with it. So that's just what tile script is. I'll show you a couple of examples of other stuff you can do here. Um, let's have a look at this is a checkerboard. Again this is something that you could easily have done with the designer but in script again three lines and all the colors are applied again very simple and at the other extreme where you want to um, put in say a design of tiles and show the customer what this is going to actually look like on the floor here's a pretty good example of this is here what we've got is if I what we do is just look at this it's a bit difficult to see because actually what it's done is it's it's actually filled all the tiles in with these images and not only that but it's blended them across the room and so it starts down here with a darker tile then in the middle it blends it and it changes to a lighter tile over there now obviously it goes without saying if, if you're the sort of company that does this a lot this is a you know a fantastic tool if, if you if you think scratching your head thinking I'd never need to do that well that's fine you never need to do it but it, it's an example of what Calidus can do for you with the tile script and again if I just show you what's going on with that don't worry too much about what's going on here but that entire design which is the it's a 50 centimeter tile 
blended across with two images running across there. That's done with six lines of tile script. And what's really good about it is if you've got that same effect needs to go into a couple of offices alongside there, well, because the design for everything is actually held within tile script, you apply that script to different rooms and you get exactly the same design pattern working in here. And again, if we go to the report, not only does it do the design work for you, but it also tells you how many tiles of each image you need. Gives you your overall waste factors and everything that you're quite familiar with Calidus. So the, the tile script allows you to build a grid, set colours, optionally put images on there, do certain amounts of design features, and at the same time, as always with Calidus, it's going to tell you the quantities that you need. So that's a very quick overview of what we're doing with TileScript. And once again, I would suggest that, you know, if your type of work is we do 50 centimetre tiles all day and all we need is quantities, then, you know, you, you don't really need to know too much about TileScript. But if you are finding um, more frequently that you're going into the, the um, tile designer up here and you're finding that it's struggling a bit or you're finding that the designs are more complex, have a go with the script. And uh, so that's a quick introduction to TileScript and some of these other films will go into it in more detail. So press on with the next film. Thank you.